Hello everyone, so for today's video I'm going to be doing a K-pop collection video. So yeah, so I have all my binders here, and yeah, so I'm actually going to be doing this video right before I downsize my collection. I'm going to be downsizing just a little bit of my collection, I won't go into it, but yeah, so I really wanted to kind of see how my progress is before I downsize. And I also want to say that my 17 collection is not updated at all. I'm actually going to be upsizing that collection in another future video. So because of that, a lot of it's not updated. I will be updating that binder and reorganizing um, in that video. So do check it out. <laughs> um, and yeah, I think that's everything. Um, so yeah, oh also, all of my materials will be down in the description. I typically leave them in the description anyways, but I know I'll have a few questions about these collect books and these um, binders, so I will leave everything down below. I'll try my best to put links, and same with the pages that I use and the binders that I use. Um, and yeah, and if you have any questions on how I get stuff and everything, do comment down below. I will I would love to like, uh, redirect you to where you can get the same things as me. And, yeah, I think that's everything. Um, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to start with my mini binders, then my collect books, then my non-photo card inclusions, and then my mini binder, and then my big binder. So, let's get started. So first off, we have my three mini binders, or I guess they are mini binders. So I have a 17 one, this is typically just Jihoon, a BTS one, or a High B actually, I believe TXT is also in this one, and then I have a Wong, also known as AB6 uh, mini collection too. So I guess we'll start with, <clears throat> we'll start with Wong because he's not a part of High B, and then we'll make our way over. So this is my Wong collection, um, or like the cover for it, and then this is the back. These ones, I really like this binder, so... So when you open it, I have another collage in the background, but I also have a Polaroid of Wong. Um, this isn't official or anything, he literally posted it on Instagram and I had a friend print it out, so yeah. And then here's a just photo card, so I have all of the members, this is from the Jeju, I believe. Then I have Vivid, also they're in hollow sleeves as you can tell, so yeah, so this is just the Vivid era. So for Wong, I do, or for AB6, I guess, I do collect OT4 sets. So whenever I decide not to collect this set, I'm, but I like Wong species, I typically buy Wong species. Um, I do have a lot of make start, which by the way, I really like how this looks with the hollow uh, sleeve. But this is Wong's collection. That's a new hope. This is Have a Dream Now. So, yeah. Super cute, and I also, this is one of my favorite pieces of Wong right now. It's just so pretty. And, yeah, so that's everything for Wong, um, at least for his mini collection. So. And then we have my High B one. So my cover is um, Tay and Hobi. I don't know the shoot name. Is it V Hope? I think it's V Hope. Just from my Love Yourself um, answer album that I bought and then on the back it is Namjoon and Jimin or Minjoon I think but yeah so um and then when you open it up we have a little and I think this was my first collage and I like didn't like it I like didn't like the placement that I did also sorry for the lighting I think the uh, the fake card kind of flew it off but I do have this Hobie fake card. I believe this is from the Soul Map of the Soul something. It's a DVD PC, I believe. But I made a little fake of it. And it's literally because this photograph is so pretty, but I like refuse to buy it. And then I also have uh, a Namjoon kind of collage-esque thing here. And as well as a fake one of Namjoon. I found the prints on Twitter, so I guess... So yeah, so if you want to look for it. Okay, so let's go into my BTS collection. I have a very intensive, I would think, or like a good amount of BTS cards because I actually used to collect Namsook before they got really expensive. Um, so, yeah. As much as I love collecting Namsook, they, they are expensive. BTS is quite expensive. So, but I did keep most of my uh, photo cards and I was actually very happy because I love buying BTS albums. 
So whenever I get the albums, I typically pull Namsok, which is really nice. <laughs> so, I'm also sorry, these like, the little thing keeps moving over. But this is just my little tiny Namsok collection. And then I have TXT. So I don't really have a member I really collect. I kind of just collect who I think is cute. Also, I'm so happy because I pulled the Subin PC. But yeah, most of these are just my pulls. I also pulled this Subin PC. <laughs> and then sometimes I would buy. I did try to collect Yeonjun and Taehyun at one point, but obviously TXT is pretty expensive too. But that is my high B little binder. Oops. And then we have my Jihoon mini binder. So this one has a few um, little goodies here. Also, this shows my... <laughs> Okay, so here we have like a little picket here, super cute, and then we have Low Kirby and the a TV thing from, or 17 TV thing from Caravan. Okay, and then this is the collage in the front, my friend Bella made it, I'll leave Bella in the description because I love making fun of her because she's like not proud of this um, collage at all, so I was like, no, it's really pretty, it's really pretty. Um, and then as well as the back. This is the one Bella made. So. Okay. So. Here it is. So this one is mostly just my miscellaneous Jihoon as well as his Japanese. So I downsized or like decided to stop collecting Jihoon actively I guess. So non-album wise at least. So what I'm going to be doing for Jihoon now is I'm collecting... His album PCs, and there's just some space here. Um, his album PCs, and then for non-album, I'll be collecting the annual stuff. So like Carrot Land, um, Fan Kit, Season Screenings, and like some special goods every once in a while. So that's what I'm collecting for 17 now. So because of that, I have a bunch of <laughs> non-album things I don't want to give up. So yeah, so that is just my... Jihoon mini binder. And yeah, so let's move into my collect books. So these are my collect books. So I have one dedicated to miscellaneous groups and then also one for 17. So we'll go through my miscellaneous one since that's the first one I picked up. And so yeah. So here we have um, AB6. So it's Wujin and Daehui. We have some NCT. I did attempt to collect NCT at one point, but as you guys know, NCT is pretty expensive. So I just have some Taeyong PCs. Oops. This is like really hard for some reason. And then I have Jeno and Mark. And then I have Mark's Cafe and then a Jaehyun um, sticker. I think it's the jewel case. I have some Pentagon who I also tried to collect. <laughs> and it's Hui and Yanan and then um, Yuto. And then I do have some Hyunjin from Stray Kids, Onda from Everglow, Sujin from Idol, or was from Idol, Chewon, and then um, Woyoung. I really want to collect Woyoung for her new group, but I don't think I will because I'm currently waiting for a different group to debut. If you guys follow my everything, basically, you would know who I'm talking about. But I am planning on collecting that whole group moving forward for Korean album PCs. So because of that, I'm going to have to rein myself to not collect Woyoung, even though she is one of my top biases. And then I have some Chen Shao PCs. And then Yuki from Purple Kiss. Um, I don't know why I skipped. I guess I skipped this. And then I have Goen, Goen from Purple Kiss, I believe. And then Luna. I don't know how to say her name. Sorry. And then I have Luna as a... Uh, Go on here, and then Jinsel, Heejin, and Go on. And I did try to collect Luna at one point, but they are pretty expensive as well. So these are just, I guess, collection failed my failed collections. But that's in this collect book. Now for this one. So this one is my 17 one. This one's really pretty. I really like this one. Oh, I didn't show the back. These are the backs, by the way. I don't know if that would interest anyone, but those are the backs. Okay. So this is my 17 one, like I said. So I did try to collect Teenage. So I have um, Chol and Hoshi's 
RS version and then Hoshi and Simlon's uh, white version. I have um, uh, an Ode Hope version, the beret pieces, which I also did try to collect a 13 for. And I got very close, but I gave up. I forgot why. But I have 95 line, 96. We have Sokman and then a Vernon, which this Vernon PC is so nice. So pretty too. Then we have Falling Flower Carrot version for Chan. We have Hingata. I don't know what pre-order benefit this is, but it is a troll one. And then I have a bunch of Chan because he's my second bias in 17. Um, here I have his season greeting and his Carrot Land. One of his shirt ones. I don't know which shirt it is. Then we have Incomplete, so we have Jung Han and Sukman, Ming Hao and Chan, and then I have Chan and Chol. This is from In the Soup, and this is a pre order benefit. I think it's Apple Music, maybe? Interpark? Interpark. I think this is Interpark, actually. Um, for your choice. And then I have Sukman and Chan. And I'm really sad because I kind of wanted, I wanted Vernon's as well, but I was never able to find it, so. Very sad. <laughs> and then I have Joshua's carrot version PCs that um, I got in a group order. So he just looks so gorgeous. And are you guys ready for the next one? Because I'm not. Okay, let's pull it. Ah, it's these Joshua. I was so excited when I got these because he just looks so good. Like he's crazy. He's crazy for this. Also, sorry. I don't know if my camera's focusing properly, but he's crazy for it. I also skipped this by accident, but then I have Wanu and Minghao, who I pulled. So that is everything in my mini collect books, which is really exciting. I really love these mini collect books. And then now we're going to move on to my non-photo card stuff. So this is my non-photo card binder. I'm going to be honest, I never go through this binder and I never organize it. So if it's kind of messy, I do apologize, but we'll have to see. So... <clears throat> So what starts off is this, um, the Mark Polaroids from, I believe it's Hello Future. And I do just have a favorite little bookmark thing that I pulled. It's Mark as well. So yeah, I was able to pull Mark's full set for the Polaroid. By the way, I did want to collect Mark at one point, but yeah. Then I just have these stickers in the background. Then I just have this Jihoon semicolon, um circle card thing oval card yeah i don't know <laughs> then we just have some namjoon stuff um i have a boy with love flyer i think and then the um ban ban con i think it's like the battery pack i think i'm not sure correct me if i'm wrong but i think that's it then i have the what are these called again <laughs> um the light stick pcs so i have namsook and then i just have a namjoon love yourself I think it's the Love Yourself tour cards. I don't know. BTS has so much stuff. Then I have the main cards for Fromis. So I pulled... I I got G1 as a freebie and I pulled... No, wait. Yeah, yes. I got G1 as a freebie from someone and then I, got, I pulled Jisun. <laughs> Goodness, that was hard for me to remember. And then we have Itzy. So I have the Polaroids and the pre-order benefits here. So nice. And then I just have a bunch of blank pages. And then we go into Ataka postcards. So I have a uh, vocal unit, who obviously is in the front because Jihoon. We have hip-hop unit and then performance unit. Oops. And then, oh, okay. I guess that's just the back. And then I just have these ones. I think this one is Chan and this is, no, I think this one's Hoshi and this one. One of this is Hoshi and Chan, <laughs> but I don't know which one, but yeah. And then I have the Polaroid from Love and Letter for Jihoon. I have Jihoon's AL1 postcard. And then the Director's Cut postcards. I have Jihoon's set in here. And then I have the Season's Greetings for 2020. 2020, I think? Yeah. Then I have Incomplete. This, like, what is it? Like a, I don't know what it's called. Um, a standee photo, I think. <laughs> I don't know. And then I have Carrot Land. And then I have this Mina, the index card for Mina. And then the postcard of Dahyun. And then I have Wung. I believe this is from Have a Dream. I really don't remember. And then I have um, 
nine way ticket we're from is this is Chaeyoung and then I um, I bought Chaeyoung's on Makari and then this is uh, Jihan who I pulled then we have Yeji's um, Target version for the postcards and then her standee so that's everything in this mini binder or this non photo card binder now to my miscellaneous photo card binder so then we have this binder this binder houses um ab6 itsy from s9 and weekly and i am going to be downsizing this binder after this video i will make a video on it and we'll talk about my process and like everything like that but let's get started um by the way i typically when it comes to um putting away photo cards i try my best to keep to make sure that i don't put them all away but with AB6, I just really love AB6's photo card so much that sometimes I don't even want to film it just because I want to be in the moment when I finish these collections. So because of that, all of AB6 is updated. Um, and then Weekly is also updated, but that's just because I'm downsizing that collection as well as Itzy. So I just wanted to preface that just in case, like, I don't know. But this is my mo complete i did complete it which i'm so excited about it looks so nice and so pretty i just ah i love it and then we have have a dream i hope i can finish this next year this is one of my biggest goals and then we have salute version this is not correct oh uh, what uh, hold on hold on everyone i just noticed that i put them in the hello i just noticed i put them in the wrong order what that's so weird i've never okay Anyways, this is Salute version. That's so weird. Okay, this is a Salute album. And then we have Vivid, Sixth Sense, and then I have nothing for their debut yet. So, so sad. And then we have Fromis. So this is just a bunch of her pre-order cards, her pre-order photo cards that I have. And then these are her album cards. So, um... I'm blanking on these album names, so I do apologize. I believe this is from Nine, and then this is, um, oh gosh, I don't remember. I'm so sorry. I'm, like, blanking out so bad. Wait, Today. Oh, it's Today. Okay, I'm, I'm so, I'm sorry. I'm so blanking right now. This is so crazy, but I believe this is Today, and this is from Nine, and then this is Fun Factory, and then My Little Society, and then we go into Sujin. I'm also gonna suit. I'm going to fuck up weeklies because weekly has like we are, we can, we play. I know holiday. I think this is we can, and this no 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 wait. I think this is we are. This is their season screenings from 2020, I believe, and then this is we can, I believe. Yes. Okay, and then these are we can. Um, photo cards. I, don't ask me the version. I my brain. <laughs> and then this is we play. And then this is holiday. So I did complete her, which is really exciting. And then we have itsy. So it's it's icy. I think. What is wannabe's comeback name? It's me. Yes, it is. It's me. Not shy. And then uh, I don't know what month it is. I think this is May. Of the. No Bad Days, I think, maybe, not sure. And then we have Crazy in Love, which I did complete, which I'm so excited, it just looks so pretty. Ah. And that's everything for mis Miscellaneous, which is really surprising, I feel. But that's that, and then now we're gonna go into my 17 binder. Okay, sorry for your background noise. But this is my 17 binder, and I did change the sleeves again. Um, I recently changed it to Tiny Shield, but because of the fact that it made my binder a little too thick, um, when I upsized my 17 collection, it got a little too thick for this binder, so I put them back to my Office Depot ones. So yeah, so this is my Ataka page. <laughs> Um, obviously a lot of the photo cards haven't came in yet, as you guys can tell. Um, the purple, since 17 is the only one that has this, the purple represents that it arrived, and yeah, and then when it's clear like this with the hollow sleeve, it means that I secured it. So I'm currently waiting for a lot of my Ataka stuff still, and I don't even know my pulls yet. Uh, hopefully that gets sorted soon, because I really do want to get all of my Ataka stuff. But I joined a lot of group orders, so I have to be patient. <laughs> and then 
And this is the rest of the album ones. And then here we do have Your Choice. Um, yeah, so this is Your Choice and then Hingata. And then in the center I have a Yitsuyu um, Your Choice PC that did arrive. And then we have an Ode, which I love an Ode. An Ode looks so nice. And then we have You Make My Day, uh, Director's Cut, Teenage, and then Gose. I am missing a uh, Gose still, so if anybody has that. And then we go into this one. So this is AL1, um, I think Love and Letter, and then Boys B. And then this is dedicated to Jihoon's birthday box. I wasn't able to secure it, but I'm hoping that Weaver's... Oops. I'm hoping that Weaver's does like a um, restock or something because I know they did it for um, Jonghan. So I'm really, really hoping they do a restock soon because I really want to secure it. But yeah. So this is also one of the annual things I'm collecting on album for Jihoon. So if Jihoon does birthday boxes every year or Hi B does birthday boxes every year, I probably will be securing it. And then these are just miscellaneous stuff, so I guess I'll go through it. This one is the 2019 Season Screenings. I just bought it, so I'm waiting for it to arrive. This is the Make Star um, collaboration with Sa The Same? The Sam? I'm not sure, but that's what that is. And then this is the, I think, Qingdao? Qing, Qingdao? Um, an old fan sign PC. This is supposed to be the 2020 Season Screenings. This is the 24 hour watch. PC and then this one is one of the versions for Falling Flower. I'm not sure which one it is. Um, also, I'm pretty sure this is the wrong order. <laughs> ah, okay, let me fix that real quick. So, I don't know what version this is, it might be limited version B. And then I have the Carol Land for um, Falling Flower. Uh, Car what? Carol Land? I have the carrot version for Falling Flower. And then that's the 24 hour watch PC. This is the 2021 season greetings. This is Hitori Jinai, Hitori Jinai. And I believe this is the regular version. And then we have the Gose magazine. We have In the Soup and then the sixth anniversary pendant. And then I just secured the season greetings for this year. Um, I bought the season greetings myself. And then I also joined a group order for the Japanese version. And then here we have the fan kit. I am missing the second generation still, but I do have the third, the fourth, and the fifth, and I'm in a group order for the sixth. I did complete this, but this is the 2018 Carrotland unit PCs. So very excited that I was able to complete this. As well as Carrotland 2019, which is also completed. I am thinking of um, getting the carrot zones eventually for Carrotland for this, because I think it would look really pretty. And then I have 2020 Seasons Greetings. I also did complete this, but they're on the way, which is really exciting. Then we have Karen Land 2021. I'm still in a group order for like a pack, so I'm hoping I can pull this G Chol unit PC because I really want to complete this set already. And then we have OTU um, in Japan. So uh, for tour wise, I don't typically collect tours or Japanese tour PCs. But I decided for an ode I would because an ode is one of my one of the iconic tours in my opinion because that's the one that I saw 17 for the first time. So that's what this layout is. As well as oops. As well as in Korea. So this is the OTU in Korea one. So I am missing one of the DVD PCs, which I am willing to buy. And then also I'm missing the last um OTU trading card. So if anybody has that as well, I'm willing to buy. But yeah, and then these are just carrot zones. Um, and then that's the DVD PC, which I don't know what DVD it is. It might be regular version, so I'm missing the Blu-ray, I believe. And then we have Incomplete, because Incomplete was the uh, the concert that they did during um, quarantine. So, yeah. And then I have this DVD. I am looking for the Polaroid of 96 line. I'm not looking for the other version of this. I'm literally looking for the Polaroid. So if anybody's selling 96 lines Polaroid, I know it has two of the most popular members in it. I'm aware. But if anybody's selling that, please, please DM me. Um, that'd be great. But this is the trading cards. And I believe that's... Oh, 
nope, just kidding. I have my OT13 section. So this is just more for um, OT13 sets that I get that I don't sell. So I am planning on not selling the season greetings this year. So that's what this is. And then as well as the fourth generation um, fan club, I have OT13 for. So it's 95, 96, 97, and then Makne. So yeah. So yeah, that was everything for my K-pop collection. Oh my goodness, that was so much. Um, I really do hope you guys enjoyed. Um, like I said, everything that I buy or everything I use will be down below in the description. I'll even try to make it the pinned comment maybe, um, if I remember. And yeah, so that's everything. That was a lot. Um, stick tuned to my future videos. So I'm going to be doing a setup my new 17 collection i'm not gonna hint but i maybe am collecting more members so i'm gonna be doing that type of video and then as well as setting up my twice collection because i am going to be collecting twice now um or twice for this comeback well i'll explain in that video and then as well as i'm planning on doing a collection goals or like yeah collecting goals a video for 2022 and then i'm also going to be doing a downsizing video because i am just downsizing this binder so, yes, that is everything, I believe. Thank you guys so much for watching. I will see you guys in my next video. Hope you guys are excited for the upcoming videos. Goodbye!